The Dynalux Radio Hour brings you another exciting chapter of Bang Pal Science Fiction Adventures for shut-ins and other malcontents. Tonight's episode, Planet of the Gorilla Suit, written by Guy Benoit. Chapter 3, Mars Underground. When we last left our heroes, a fierce gorilla suit from Mars was pointing his ray gun at Rhett. Look out, Rhett! That gorilla just blasted a hole in the side of the rocket ship! The gorilla suit again points the ray gun at Rhett Dickey and takes careful aim. Izarla, who has by this point regained her senses, points and screams again. Nuku naku, yiki yiki! Excuse me? At this very moment, Blort the killer robot appears from the rocks. What in blazes is that? Blort quickly disarms the gorilla suit. They grapple for a moment before the gorilla suit quickly retreats. That's a big hole in the rocket ship. Yes, they... Suddenly, a blaring voice emerges from Blort, startling our heroes. Israela, tiki tiki, gordo not zoon flat. Hearing that, Izarla obediently runs over to Blort and stands by his side. We come from Earth. We're here to find out why you're ruining all our cars. Follow this robot. It could be a trap. Yes, we are on Mars, you know. Yes, yes. Well, we have no choice. I'd follow her anywhere. Blurt, Izarla, Rhett Dickey, Bucky Dickey, Dr. Von Braad, and El Roca approach what appears to be a large hatch in the ground. What was that? Quick, the gorilla suits are returning. You must descend. Everyone goes down into the underground fortress. There they enter the vast throne room of Lepton the Lethal, the evil ruler of Mars. Who are you? I am Lepton the Lethal, ruler of Mars. I assure you, are more invaders from Brooks. No, we are from Earth. Is that the third planet from the sun? Yes. Well, we call it Brooks. We call it Earth. Well, you're in my lair, albeit not for long. How can you speak English? <laughs> Your Earth languages are child's play. Mere nouns and consonants. I figured it out as soon as I heard you over the listenoscope. Oh, we must hear more about your scientific advances. No, actually, you must die. What? As invaders of Mars, you are to be incinerated. Izala, get the smolderator. Yes, Master. Wait, you can't incinerate us. We just got here. Nonsense. You shall meet the same fate as your predecessors over there. Holy smokes. That is an awfully big pile of bones. Those must be the remains of previous explorers of Mars who never returned to Earth. I remember hearing about that. Ah, you brought the smolderator. Now destroy them, is our luck? No, Master. Can't we keep them alive and send them to work in the giant tarantula mine? Destroy them. Yes, Master. Is this the end of our heroes? Tune in tomorrow for another pulse-pounding chapter of Planet of the Gorilla Suit, brought to you by our new sponsor, Asbestos Brand Cigarettes. Nine out of ten doctors in iron lungs recommend Asbestos Brand Cigarettes for Americans 8 to 80. 